Hi guys, it's your new math person. Today I'll be going over question 147 on SO exam P. So pause the video real quick and try to spam yourself. Okay, assuming you already attempted it, let's just dive right in. So the amount of claim payment that a car insurance company pays out follows an exponential distribution. So we know that for exponential distribution, the expectation of x is equal to lambda. If it's equal to lambda, then the variance of x we know to be lambda squared. Okay, anyways, by imposing a deductible D, the insurance company reduces the claim payment. I'm going to denote Y as claim payment. So they reduced claim payment, the expected payment, by 10%. So if expectation of Y is equal to 0.1 times the expectation of X, that's basically what they're saying. Calculate the percentage of the reduction on the variance of the claim payment. So they're saying, what is the variance of Y? Well, we know that if um, expectation of x is equal to lambda and the variance of x is equal to lambda squared, we just square the whole thing. So same idea here, technically. This is going to be equal to 0.1 expectation of x, the whole thing squared. So then the variance, actually, the reduction of variance was just 0 0.01 or 1%, which is your answer A. I hope that kind of makes sense intuitively, too, because if they just tell you, oh, this the expected payment of exponential function um, reduced by 10%, the change for a variance is just going to be 10% squared. So that's going to be 0 0.01, which is our answer. <laughs> if you guys have any questions, as always, make sure you link them down below. Otherwise, make sure you like, subscribe, and share. Bye!